morning, 47. We have a lead on the shadow client. ICA White Hats have traced the anonymous data received by our clients to one Olivia Hall, brilliant young hacktivist and suspect in a dozen cases of cyber vandalism. Using onion routing with state-of-the-art encryption, Hall went to a lot of trouble to stay untraceable. She is good, but we are better. Her digital trail has led us to a remote farm in Colorado, where satellite footage has revealed what appears to be the training camp for a private militia, led by an already registered target, Sean Rose, Australian environmental terrorist and explosives expert wanted for a series of public bombings. Rose was spotted near the scene of Thomas Cross's kidnapping, which makes him our prime suspect for the shadow client. Spurred by Eric Soders, the ICA board of directors has asked us to infiltrate the farm and eliminate Sean Rose, along with three other prominent militia members. Ezra Berg, retired Mossad interrogator, Penelope Graves, former Interpol anti-terror analyst, and finally, Maya Parvati, former assassin and gun runner for the Tamil Tigers. I'll be honest with you, 47. I consider Eric Soda's reasoning hasty and ill-advised. Now, we cannot go against the wishes of the board, but we can conduct our own investigation. Whether a direct threat to the ICA or not, we need to know the Shadow Client's true agenda. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Colorado, 47. The militia has taken up HQ at an old apricot farm and appear to be training for a series of coordinated strikes, ranging from cyber attacks to full-blown guerrilla warfare. The Shadow Client appears to unite specialists and radicals from all over the map, mercenaries and terrorists, hackers and spies joined by an unknown common cause. Satellite scans indicate that the command room is below ground inside an old tornado shelter. Only Rose appears to have access, however, so to get inside, you will need to get creative. This environment is hostile and highly alert, so tread carefully. Good luck, 47.
mask. Ezra Berg, legendary Mossad operative who specializes in chemical interrogation techniques, is here at the compound to interrogate a prisoner. My notes indicate he set up a makeshift drug lab in a garage, and it looks like he's spending a lot of his time in the basement. Could be an opportunity there, 47. What the hell are you talking about? I was just at the security station watching the feeds. There's this creepy guy interrogating the hostage. He wears like a 3D printed mask. Oh, yeah, that must be Bird. Oh, yeah, man, his interrogation techniques totally just out of the box. Ezra Berg, legendary Mossad operative who specializes in chemical interrogation techniques, is here at the compound to interrogate a prisoner. My notes indicate he set up a makeshift drug lab in a garage, and it looks like he's spending a lot of his time in the basement. Could be an opportunity there, 47. talking about? I was just at the security station watching the feeds. There's this creepy guy interrogating the hostage. Where's like a 3D printed mask? Oh, yeah, that must be bird. Oh, yeah, man. They don't like to mark up their patients. So, those are the shot boys. What are you talking about? I was just at the security station watching the feeds. There's this creepy guy interrogating the hostage. He wears like a 3D printed mask. Oh, yeah. That... Wait a minute.
six. Could be a bomb guy. Did you know the name of America? Hey! Oh, God damn it! Hey! Dice! Make this one. like a quiet beat. I'm a bit bored, actually. Good work. Keep your eyes open. Yeah. Yeah. Later. Alright. Okay, I, I need to get my head out. Look, I appreciate that you've been assigned to protect me, but please. <laughs> Leave me alone for a few. That individual is still breathing. This is your mess. Oh, you are so dead, you little wanker. That's, that's it again. Did you see that? I've never seen anything like that before. I think I can pull it around here. Wow. That's a big old sheep that made me. They'll probably come down from the Rockies to get the food. Listen, I know. I know this sounds nuts. But that thing out there, it had four legs. But it, but it was crawling like a lizard. Like a, like a big snake. Sure. Maybe you should have the gancho. Hmm. Man, I thought I heard something. Checking it out. Over.
Hey, don't wave that around. Just cross your fingers that the damn thing doesn't fire again. Rose gets a lot of important phone calls. It's mad as hell. That is Penelope Graves, acclaimed anti-terror analyst. Strange to see her as part of this crowd. Not a country boy, huh? Huh, yeah. So what's wrong with the relay station, anyway? Switch is loose. Old model. If it happens again, I guess we can weld it in place or something. Well, I'm sure if it comes to that. Hey, I'm kind of lost here. I mean, it's literally my first weekend. I already got chewed out by Rose. What's the deal with him? Well, to be honest, he gives me the creeps. I don't much appreciate his methods. I'm more of a see the whites of their eyes kind of soul. Wrong. And the others? I mean, how's the general consensus? The boss picked him for a reason. That's good enough for me. Therefore, people like him or not. I think it might be fair. That is Penelope Graves, acclaimed anti-terror analyst. Strange to see her as part of this out. So, Sir, the walls will be just fine. No need to try and keep them up. I need to do something on my own here, so just... Hey, keep on doing that and you'll be scraping shrapnel out of your leg. Glad you gained your sanity. I'm kind of lost here. I mean, it's literally my first weekend. I already got chewed out by Rose. Very charming. It's a beautiful piece of work. What's this I hear about a training accident? That would be Burgess, the sharpshooter. A battering ram has injured one of the strike team, point man by the name of Burgess. And according to those militiamen, Maya Parvati oversees training. Sounds promising. I suggest you infiltrate the strike team 47. Perhaps you can relieve the hapless point man of his duties. Just, just put your gun away, please. It's making me nervous. Coffee today, I guess. Just cross your fingers that the damn thing doesn't fire again. Rose gets a lot of important fun. Easy does it.
Security's in the house. That is Maya Parvati, a Sri Lankan assassin turned pirate, turned insurgent. Broken bones. Wounded pride. That's all. Good to hear. All right, head over to the briefing area. We'll resume in a moment. expect you all to know this by heart but in case amnesia has set in here's the sequence advance to the car with haste eliminate the passengers retrieve the briefcase extract got that and remember speed and accuracy is the name of the game all right now go pick up your weapons and get in position move out far away far away Stop choking that person right now! That is Maya Parvati, I'm Sri back. Lankan assassin well, turned well. pirate turned insurgent. Any broken bones? Wounded pride. That's all. Good to hear. All right, head over to the briefing area. We'll resume in a moment.
right people. Let's get to it. Burgess is back. We're finally ready to make this happen. I expect you all to know this by heart. But in case amnesia has set in, here's the sequence. Advance to the car with haste. Eliminate the passengers. Retrieve the briefcase. Extract. Got that? And remember, speed and accuracy is the name of the game. All right. Now go pick up your weapons and get in position. Move out! Don't save your ammo on this guy! Rose. Parvati, please proceed. Pretend I'm not here. Not a problem. All right, let's go again. On your marks. Ready. Set. Execute. That's just not good enough. Speed, accuracy. See, this needs to improve. Team's performance was passable but lacks coordination. The point is to build up muscle memory, a perfect sequence of synchronized motion. We've been through this before. All due respect, boss, shit will go wrong. We'll need to improvise. If you do what I tell you, nothing will go wrong. Not on my watch. Do it again. Far a will! Far a will! All right, All right let's, let's go again. On your marks, ready, set, execute. Nicely done, 47. Parvati won't know what hit her. You are stagnating, people. We'll need to wrap it up and revise our strategy. I don't like the. Maya Parvati is down. Good work. Oh, shit. Oh, you were at Jordan Cross's funeral, huh? Oh, it was a thing of beauty. Whole team moving like clockwork. Perfect execution. Thomas Cross was off site before his guards even noticed. Man, wish I could have been there. So who's this next target? Gustavo Torres. Mister, what the hell? Who did this? What's his problem? Seriously, anyone know this guy? There will be no Torres warning is shots. They're just saying, man. Be good, man. Just try and show your face here again. Whatever. Stay away.
Confirmed down. Nicely done, 47. Got his way to help. The client is compromised. Rose is down. All units respond. Talk to me. What's going on? Rose? No. God damn it. We got a situation. You possibly ready to run the roll. I don't know. I can't give you a description. Shit! Oh. Someone killed Maya. All units respond. Who did this? Requesting assistance. We got a situation here. Better lock and load. Sons of Solidarity? No, they're a bunch of left wing cult. I just watched an interview with that billionaire presidential candidate last night. You know, the one with the famous hairdo. Ah, that guy seems so well composed and has such a refined academic way to use his arguments. Flanked with well-researched facts and figures. Yeah, he's honest and, and trustworthy. What do you think? I'm gonna pretend I didn't... I don't even... Huh.
Okay. I advise you to slow down a little. I'm telling you, back in the day, my pops were not even allowed to mail. Strange noises here. Looking into it. Hello? Stop the straggling right now! I'm taking you with me! There's room for everyone here, man. Sorry, strict orders, my friend. Access denied. Yeah, you know the drill. Yeah, no. I'm gonna give this more time. Wait a minute. Man, just heard a strange noise. I'm gonna check it out. Please stand by. Hey, anyone there? Command, we're good. Stand Sir, this is off limits. That's gonna... We might have a situation. I'll check the perimeter. Over. Nothing here. Returning to post. What the... Ah! Eyes open! Command, how do you read? Over. Command, I have an unidentified person here. Confirm, Command. Over.
That is Ezra Berg, Why? former Mossad interrogator. His services are in demand at the moment. Don't move. I'll go check. Oh, damn, isn't he? Who? The guy. The guy Ezra Berg has tied up in the interrogation room. He's one of the enemy's couriers. Heralds. They call themselves Heralds, posh bastards. The enemy uses them to communicate with me. Don't worry, special forces are here. Is that a weapon? Jesus Christ! Hmm. Unconscious. Well done, 47. With any luck, the perfectionist Ezra Berg will want to examine his notes closely to figure out what happened. Ezra Berg has been eliminated. Good work, 47. Brilliant. In all its improvised glory. Cobb. The plane director, his plane crashed. Hey! 
Hey, who are you? Sir, I'm talking to you. I don't know. And the enemy has to have known about Iago. I probably even used their services. You didn't see it there. That thing made Ezra Berg's interrogation mask? That's what it does. It's a 3D printer. It oh. prints things in... Come on. Wait for it. I'm fine.
That's what it does. It's a 3D printer. It prints things in, wait for it, three dimensions. I know what it does. I just have a hard time grasping it. Could we print out our own weapons? Sure. Maybe a small gun for something really specific. There's beautiful tech for assassins, but old school weapons are still cheaper and more reliable. So I hear Rose had his own face scan for 3D masking after he saw Berg's mask. One of the hackers keeps the face data on his laptop. I'm Penelope Graves. Now, you look like you've been part of the crew for a while. Wondering how you're finding it here. Sean Rose, okay to work with? Well. To be honest, it gives me the cries. Uh, whatever. I don't much appreciate his methods. I'm more of a see the whites of their eyes kind of soldier. Remote bombings just seem wrong. So I just found out that Hawaii is a Tamil tiger. So this test that Rose has planned seems kind of cruel, doesn't it? I mean, I'm no softy or anything, but it feels excessive. She's got it coming. And nobody can switch sides like Graves and, and just expect to be accepted. Tests are in order, man. Yeah, sure, I get that. But playing on her past with Interpol like that? I... I don't know, man. But I just hope the technician knows how to act. She used to be the enemy. I don't have any sympathy for that. I'm sure he'll be fine. He's got the badge, right? Yeah, he showed it to me over by the tent. Rehearsed his lines, too. He's taking this pretty seriously. Should be in the clear. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see if she takes the off. Not to mention I'm part of the job. I hear you. Rose put you on the Mexico. Ah, uh, great. Only the bet. Ah, uh, don't mind me here. Try again. The bloody Russians hijacked our satellite. Oh, okay. Uh, 
wait. So you're all set for the sting? Sure. Got a badge in my pocket, prep my lines. Shouldn't be a problem. Almost game time. Um, you, uh, think you can hook her? Graves is new. She comes by every two seconds to check on her work. She's paranoid enough to bite. So Rose basically wants you to pretend you're with Interpol, uh, get her to come with you, uh, and then what? I'm supposed to lure her to the slurry pit and tell her to roll over on Rose and the rest of us. Try to get her to turn on us. Interested to see how she reacts. Is she gonna ask the guys there to shoot me, or will she give up everything? Yeah, it's a big decision. What if she takes the bait? Well, then Rose is gonna find her a kick her ass, I imagine. Still nothing. So the damn satellite fell out of orbit or something. All right, you get the signal now. Back up here. I'm off to the bathroom, not feeling too. Ugh. Hi there, Grunt. Poison. I need to.
Penelope Graves. We need to talk. You're... Uh... What is this? I'll explain everything at the slurry pit. It will be in your best interest to do as I say. I understand. I'll the see you there. are here. Miss Graves, you were being recruited back into Interpol as an insider. What? I... Who are you anyway? How did you find me? That is not important. Think about this carefully. You could provide us with valuable intel. If you cooperate, the agency will overlook your unfortunate transgression. <sighs> and what if I refuse, huh? If I scream and get the guards here? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Might prove... Unhealthy. I'll give you a few moments to think about it. Good work, 47. This should give her something to think about. Okay. Hey, can you just leave me alone for a few minutes? I've got some thinking to do. I'm sure Rose won't mind. Flight out of Lyon under assumed name. Passport provided through Delgado and that Palacio guy. Look clean. Changed clothes at JFK and again at Denver International. Charred the passport after leaving the hotel. Burner phone was dropped before I left the flight. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's very sweet of you to follow me around on Rose's request, but, oh, guess what? I'm a big girl. I can handle myself for a few minutes, all right? Thank you. Think, Graves. How did they get to you? Flight out of Lyon under assumed name. Passport provided through Delgado and that vanisher guy. That's all targets taken care of, 47. Now gain access to the tornado shelter.
Okay, I, I need to clear my head and have some privacy here. Look. Hey, whoa. Think, Graves. How did they get to you? Flight out of Lyon under assumed name. Passport provided through Delgado and... That Malaysia guy. I could look clean. Changed clothes at... Client has been That's all targets taken care of, 47. Now gain access to the tornado shelter. All targets taken care of, 47. Now gain access to the tornado shelter. Day keeps getting better and better. 
Yes, you are the man. Forty-seven. It appears the door to the tornado shelter is protected by a biometric lock. To gain access, you need Sean Rose's body, or something equally convincing. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah.
Did I tell you? I found another one yesterday. Another one? Oh, do tell. Okay, so you know how Rose keeps his desk tidy like a Japanese garden, right? Anyway, someone knocked a pen. Bloody hell! Don't we have security? Identify yourself! You! Don't move! You know what? I don't even care. Oh, I can't deal with it. I just can't. The plot thickens. Someone left in a hurry. Sean Rose was not the Shadow Client. That much is clear. Whoever commands the militia, they got out just in time. Look around, 47. We're getting closer. Some kind of network. Power players. From all sectors. Familiar faces, too. Thomas Cross. Klaus Strandberg, Ether, and that's missing banker Eugene Cobb. Well, well. There's a name. Providence. What? No. No, it can't be. The Hidden Hand. Thought they were a myth. A hypothesis, nothing more. The idea that a small cabal of kingmakers, controlling enough corporate and political leaders, could effectively run the world in secret. Maybe not so hypothetical. Keep looking, 47. We need full disclosure. Someone's done their homework. Look how far it dates back. Hayamoto, Beldingford, Delvade. The Shadow Client has been tracking you for decades. Now how is that possible? It isn't. Every one of those missions were branded as unsolved or accidents. He must have been looking for a pattern, a certain M.O., which would mean... He knows me. Well, at least this shortens the list. Found something. Sodas. But that would mean Providence has infiltrated ICA. And Eric Sodas is their operative. Bastard! It all fits. He was the one who persuaded the rest of the ICA board to greenlight this operation. This changes everything. Get out, 47. We got what we came for. What about the Shadow Clan? He is no longer our primary concern. ICA has been compromised. I always wondered if Providence was real, but I never actually... I will need to confer with the board, but mark my words, 47. This will have consequences.
Rose is gone. It was me, wasn't it? They tracked me. I don't believe it. I took every precaution. Rose knew the risks. They all do. You did well, Olivia. I am proud of you. Now listen. The ICA knows about you. They kept you alive because they needed you, and now they don't. We won't talk again. Not until the storm is over. I don't like it. This man nobody's capable of. You need to end this now. I ran away as a boy. My friend and I, away from that place. We came upon a small farming community. The people were dirt poor, but this woman, she took us in. We were awakened the next morning by the shots. A dozen people lay face down in the snow. A warden didn't like to leave witnesses. They shot the woman and her family last. They made sure that we watched the whole thing. This is your gift, the warden told us. Your gift and your curse. Touching lives only by ending them. better than anyone.